Okay, good morning guys. So I'm Chester Troy Baluyo from Group Ego. So today I'm here at the uh, Amar Computer College to discuss you about uh, oscilloscope or scope for short. So for this demonstration, we will use AL5D oscilloscope. Okay? Uh, the oscilloscope previously we know as a uh, oscillograph or informally known as a scope is a tool that allows you to display waveforms. So it allows you to see voltages and circuit as a function of time. Oscilloscopes are used in the science, medicine, engineering, and telecommunication industry. So general purpose instruments are used for maintenance of electronic equipment and laboratory work. For you to use the oscilloscope, you need this test probe. So this test probe is specialized and expensive. So please handle them with care. Different kind of waveform. Sine wave, <laughs> square wave, soft wave, step that means how. For this segment, we will teach you how to use an oscilloscope. For the first step, turn power on. Once the power is on, it is normal for a power indicator or line indicator light to come on. Step 2. Wait for oscilloscope display to appear. Even modern semiconductor ones often need time for their electronics to boot up. Step 3. Find the trace. Usually the trace will become visible. If not, the beam finder button can be pressed and this will locate the trace. Step 4. Set the gain control. This should be set so that the expected trace will nearly fill the vertical screen. Step 5. Set the time base speed. The actual setting will depend on what needs to be seen. Step 6. Apply the signal. With the control set approximately correctly, the signal can be applied and an image should be seen. And lastly, adjust the trigger. The trigger level control will be able to control where on the waveform the time base is triggered and hence the trace starts on the waveform. Now we will discuss the basic controls for AL510 oscilloscope. Note that only the currently selected trace will be affected by the controls in this group. 2. Horizontal. Controls the time scale and position. Note that all traces are affected simultaneously by these controls. 3. Trigger. Controls the triggering. This is useful for horizontally aligning a repeating signal with itself. 4. Acquire. Controls the method of acquiring samples. It also has the auto set button that will cause the oscilloscope to automatically choose settings for all the other controls that it thinks will be best display the current waveforms. This is a very useful button, but I have found it chooses good values about 80% of the time. 5. Miscellaneous. This section is the unlabeled set of controls that is at the top of the control panel. The controls in this section are mostly high-level functions that are not specific to a given waveform. It is in this section that you find the general purpose knob referred to later. And lastly, selector buttons along the right and bottom of the screen. These are used to select from menus that appear on the bottom and right of the screen, just like you would do with an ATM machine at the bank. Chester Troy Baluyo, your reporter. Hi, I'm Don Carlos Elardia II, the director. Yo. Hi, I'm Mr. Gordon, reporter too. Dali ko, sige, dali ko na. 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, wala kaya na. Okay, I'm going to go to the next one. 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 I'm going to go to the
One, two, three, four. Pagkang kami lang pa. Stop, take nga lang. Sabi ko, magbaya ka lang. One, two, three, go. Tapos wala ka lang gagawin. Sabi nga na lang siya. Stop, take nga lang. Hindi, ilig mo yan. One, two, three, go. Tapos wag ka lang. Haya mo kami. Sabi nga sa iyo. Sige, sige, sige. Magbaya ka lang. One, two, three. Sabi nga lang. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Tapos, where's the two people? Basta kikliko na lang ha, sabihin nyo, go agad. We are the two people. Kaya ko lang. Ay, just me. Sige! Bilalaw, bilalaw! Ala, just me na alam! Pag nakarap kami nga pa, sumenyos ka lang, okay? O, sige. Gangnam Style Gangnam Style Gangnam Style